Welcome back to Let's Play SimCity 3000 with me, Squire. Can you join me on the main menu? Because I have bad news. Um, unfortunately, yesterday, my laptop decided it absolutely had to update, otherwise the universe would implode if I didn't update. So, when it did update, it, for some reason, erased my save games off SimCity 3000. I don't exactly know why, this seems to be the only game that got affected by it, but nevertheless my laptop decided No, 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 you must be on the next operating system, you cannot be running Windows Vista Service Pack 1, you must be using Service Pack 2. So it decided to, well, basically kick me in the bollocks and uh, erase London. So that leaves me with, what the fuck do I do? Well. I know this will be the third city I've started to series, but this is going to be the last city, so if anything fucks up, then that's where I'm going to call it quits. But this time I thought we'd have a look at a different feature, you know, we've got an excuse to look at a different feature, so this time we're going to be starting a new city from scratch. So, this will be, be something fun, so we're going to create, you know, this time, I'm not going to adhere it to like a template, I'm just going to let my imagination run wild, and obviously you guys were along for the ride, and as always, I will take suggestions off you. So I'm going to call my city... Where did I get pizza from last night? I might just call it that. Oster. Because that's where I got my pizza from last night. And I'm going to have a large city size. Uh, start date 1900 to get disasters are on, auto budgets on. So let's pick a uh, good setting for my city. Um, uh, I quite like the yellow terrain actually, uh, that, might, that might suit my city, and as for trees, um, what building style should we go for, should we go for Asian or American, because I'll not go with European again, we've, we've had a look at the European texture, so let's go American this time around, um, yeah, so actually we'll make it a desert, and then as for trees, yeah, I'll make, um, can make them cactuses. Uh, now I'm going to have palm trees in my city. Alright, so let's uh, kick this city off and then we're going to have a look at the terraforming tools in this game. And what does the llama... Oh, no llama? Okay. But here we go. We've got a blank template. This could, I could just say, fuck it, we'll start a city now. But I thought, let's let's just play around with some of this. So like, we can change like the rivers. We could have... Oh, we could have all sorts here. So, um, I don't know. I'm just going to stop clicking in. Three, two... One. There we go, we're going to have a lake in the middle of our city then. Um, oh, I could turn these on and off so I could have it like... I could make an island actually, you know what? Oh. Yeah, that's going to be so cool, we're going to have an island with a lake in it. Let's just regenerate and see what it looks like. That is fucking cool. We could also adjust the parameters so we could say how much water we have, so... Uh, I don't know. We'll keep the water about middling. We'll keep, we're gonna, I'm gonna maximize the amount of trees we have and then hills. Um, yeah, we could have some hills going on, so let's have a look at what we get this time. Ooh, this is interesting, so yeah. Donut Island, I wish I could rename my, I think I could rename my city actually, so you know what, I'm gonna call it Donut Island. Because there we go, we've got some nice terrain to play with here. Like, it might, it's not as much as we have in London, but you know what, let's see what we could do with this in the span of about 150 years. Because that's how long the game sort of lasts. Because the final unlock occurs at 2050. So that's when I want to sort of like. That's how long I wanted to keep London going. Uh, there is one thing I'm going to do, but I'm going to I'm going to connect the lake to the um, to like the um, like. There we go. So it's a semi donut island. It's more of a pretzel now. But I just thought it'd be cool if like the lake could connect to the sea. So there we go. That's cool. Um, I probably could use a bit more land. So you know what? I'll just uh, I'm just gonna expand this bay out a bit. Uh, I wish I could zoom in. Oh wait, I can zoom. In. Come on. Right, zoom in. Yeah, oops. Too far. Those trees look cool. So, yeah. Let's just. Um, come on. I just want a bit more land to play with. Come on. Come on. Right, and then I'll level it, so... There we go. Oh shit, I just made that bit a little bigger, right? Let's just, uh... There we go. 
this bit better. There we go. I'll have no, I'll have no problem building a sea part on this terrain as well, which will be super cool. Uh, yeah, I keep fucking this up. You know what? I'm gonna keep those hills there. I'll just, I'll just sort of like. Say, I'll say that's like the mountain. There you go. Our city comes with a mountain. Does your city come with a mountain? Uh -huh. All right. I think that's good. Donut City. Here we go. Terrain accepted. Whenever you start a new game, the simulator is paused. Use this time to lay zones, set up initial infrastructure and the roads and utilities. When you're ready, unpause the simulator and your city will come to life, says the llama. Well, that's all well and cool, but first things first, I'm just going to go into the city options. Uh, we're not calling it Austria, what we're calling it. Donut Island. And uh, description. There we go. Alright, so Donut Island, the best city in the world. And first things first, we're gonna get a power plant going, and actually, we're gonna just. We're gonna just. I'm a game player now, so. Right, coal power plant. Um, we're gonna go with good old coal. So we've got we've got 50 grand to play with initially, so I'm gonna put the coal plant. I think this will be the uh, industrial area up here. So there we go. So let's just build some roads and shit. So. And if I and if I if I need, ever need more land, I can just terraform new land. It's just gonna cost me a lot of money. That's all. I could create artificial islands, which would be so cool. Like, oh my god. City needs everything! City needs everything! Yeah. Uh, this, this hill's gonna be residential. So, um, yeah. So I'll say that's where the industrial zone goes. Up there. And then we'll just. There we go. There, that looks cool then. What's this water like? That's salt water. Alright, what's the water in the middle? Fresh water. Right, the thing with salt water is, um,. You can't build pumping stations next to it, so I could either set up pumping facilities around a central lake, or I could go with something with a little less capacity, but water water towers could, would probably um, mean that I don't have to fiddle around with a lot of power lines and shit. So you know what, I'm going to have a water tower this time. I like that noise. Alright, let's just get some uh, pipes going and shit. So, here we go. And every every sim is just complaining right now. Like every everyone wants something for nothing in my city. That's just the way life goes in Aust well not in Oster. Stop stop using this city's dead name. It's Donut Island. Everyone wants to come to Donut Island. Right there we go. Got some water pipes going. So let's get uh, our first residential zone going. And by the way, just like you, I am still grieving. Like, I'm grieving so hard. Who wants to come up with an interesting death story for the city? Uh, that sounds better than my laptop fucking update and erase the save file. Someone please come up with a better with a better thing and I will give you my approval. And anyway, this is going to be my residential area here. It's not exactly much to look at, but I decided, but yeah. Just need to get some power flowing to it, of course. So. There we go, and oh, we got our first industrial buildings growing. Quite cool, have a grow building now without any fucking infrastructure. But oh well, it's, my, it's your choice, not mine. But let's just get some more pipes going. So then we got water just flowing through the new residential area. There we go. That looks cool. That looks cool. Um, actually, I just need to desert that tile there. That should be there. Alright, come on, let the power flow. Sims are moving to Oster, seeking new homes. Low taxes. Oh yeah, the taxes are low for once. That ain't gonna last for much longer though. Come on, power plant. Are you gonna... Dead! Donut Island. Donut Island, a powerhouse, but much of it wasted. Whatever. Now, is, is power gonna get to this fucking tile or what? On. Right, I'll, I'll even get you a, give you a second set of power lines. Look, there you go. There you go. Let's just fast forward a bit so I can. There we go. 
got dual power lines. And I'm just gonna put a road going like that. There we go, though. Sims can't get to work. Many plan to move away. Well, yeah, I probably could use uh, doing up the roads in um, this area, so. Here we go. Just get some nice roads bordering the zones. And then. That road just goes to nowhere now, but. Oh shit! Who's fucking dumping coal ash in the in the in in the sea? Look at that. Ah. I thought it was just the sea ports that did that, but it looks like um, everything else does it now. Let's go. Right, let's fucking dump this fucking coal ash in the sea because we don't have a fucking landfill. Yeah. Oh well. We got water to spare. Enough to sell. Experts advise. Okay. Uh, who do I sell it to? I'm in the middle of a fucking ocean. Not really anyone I can sell it to. Oh well. Let's just carry on with what we're supposed to do. On the legendary donut island. And ooh. Here come our first few um, houses. That looks good. Like these are nice little American houses this time around. Walton's dream. He dreamed of a not very convincing blue house. Yeah. There's another blue house. Elm Street. Why are there so many blue house? Oh, that's not a blue house. That's called Middle Road. Looks like the land value is quite good around here since, um, there's... Oh. That's some nice loud uh, construction noises there. Eh? But I guess it's on a hill and there's trees and shit, but... It's all good. It's all good. Apparently we've got a bit of air pollution and we've got no industrial demand, so that's why the air is developing. So we have got a bit of commercial demand, so... Where could I put the commercial district? Maybe on the other side of the hill, actually, because why not? So yeah, I'm just going to zone a small area, about that big. I mean, it's alright, I don't need to watch my money too much in these beginning stages. Um, I'm still so pissed that I fucking lost London. Why? 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 Right, here we go. Here's the road to the residential zone. So I build it as I go. Come on, there we go. And obviously I need to get to the power going. Let's hook up the juice. There we go. And then hook up the water. The sweet, sweet H2. Whoa. Because we need it to uh, live, apparently. And also to piss. If we didn't have water, we'd never go to the toilet, except when you need to go to the shitter. Alright, there we go. How's our water tower doing? It's halfway to capacity, so obviously if I'm going to rely on water towers, I'm probably going to need a lot of them, but I wish I could like, like, you know like in American cities and shows where they like write right the city name on a water tower? I wish I could do that on mine. Just like Donut Island on it. That'd be so cool. Up in smoke, lack of fire coverage, put city at risk. Oh yeah, I've got to build, I've got to build necessities and shit, but hey, we've got our first commercial areas popping up. Uh, we've got a giant ice cream. Cool. Uh, what's it called? Is it called a giant ice cream? Licks ice cream. Wow. I would not want my name to be Lick. That's a horrible name. A horrible pun. I guess. But then again, I guess running an ice cream shop is the only thing you can do when your name's Lick. I feel sorry for you, buddy. I feel very sorry. But what's this big building? Crazy Larry's family food market. Crazy Larry likes to make, is trying to make this building quite big, so, um, yeah, go for it, Larry. I want to see what gets me on what, uh, Ben's Diner is the fucking ugliest building in the city. Ugh, that's terrible, that. Um, I might build a park, though, because I want to. Let's put some parks down. There we go. Get some fountains going. Just because I want to kick up that value. Down some small packs here and here. There we go. Packs. See, I'm cool like that. And um, thirsty sims say, Mayor is all wet. All right, are we running out of water? Yep. The uh, tower is at capacity, so we're gonna have to found a second water tower. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna pop this one 
here in the industrial area because I said so. There we go. Let's connect up the pipes. And there we shall have water, hopefully. Oops, right, I'll just give it some time. Right, is that done? Yay! <clears throat> but we're going to need yet another water tower soon. I think once we start developing closer to the lake, that's when I'll start putting in some pumping stations. I'm sure we don't have a way of convert getting this salt water to uh, be drinkable, but it looks like we don't. And Ooh, look at that. Random island. I could do some more of that shit. I really could. Donal Island boasts excellent water system. Good, good. Uh, ooh, what's that? Crazy Larry's Family Flea Market. What, you, oh, you're building two now? What's this then? Crazy Larry's third flea... God, Crazy Larry's building a fucking empire here. It's a shame he puts all three of his flea markets next to each other, so they're just going to basically complete so hard. Oh, well. It's his choice. I did... I, 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 it's, it's, it's all up to Crazy Larry. All up to Crazy Larry. He does what he wants now. He does what he wants. I think just before the year ends, I'm going to expand the residential area a bit, because as you can see, it's grown, it's grown nicely. Nice little residential zone, which I like. And you know what? Let's just build. Look at that. That's a nice little trick. Build dual roads, you get trees. So now I'm just going to make this area just look fancy as fuck. Let's get another tree. junction going there. Then. Go green a dream, brown a frown. More parks needed in Donut Island. Should be on Donut Island, not in Donut Island. You donut. There we go. There we go. So there we go, we've got another little extra area of residential there, so let's just uh, zone it up. There we go. Actually, it's got the water, the good, the good sort of uncoloured stuff flow to it, unless water's blue here. What colour is water? I think it's uncoloured, but then a lot of people say it's like blue. Oh well. Let's just have a let's just fast forward a bit, see. There we go. More new development and oh dear. Poor people. Look. Rusted cat oh my god, scumbags have moved to the island. Ah. Great look. Oh, Zeke's uncles. Oh great, we've got white trash. We've got fucking trailer trash moving into a city. I guess that's what happens when you build the industrial district. The people in my nice middle class homes work, work there with their above ground pools and their garages. Nope. They just go to the industrial areas and while my nice people go to the... Uh, well, the two motels which have now been built on the fucking same plot of land, and I suspect that's going to be a third one. No, it's another fucking flea market. Crazy Larry, you got a, you got a calm your fucking uh, flea market addiction here, mate. But our residential demand is climbing much better now, so yeah. Even if it means inviting more trailer trash into the city, I think we're going to have to um, just uh, start building more stuff. So um, basically, what I'm going to do is just. Build up the uh, area bordering the hills because the hills gonna be where we put some nice hot stuff. So there we go. Bit of an odd looking road, but you know what? I kind of like that road. So there we go. Yeah. Let's just get the get the water flowing, 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 flowing. No schools. It sits in Donut Island. Same, same, same. Mayor has a lot to learn. Simpson also realised that the mayor has to get a fucking good tax base going before I can start spending shit on shit. Then it's gonna do the same here as well, so it's like there we go. Just make a diagonal road. And just go sort of like go um It's like the most awful road I've ever built in my life, just building a road around the hill in Jonah Island. I feel like this hill might represent, represent one of the sprinkles on the donut, like if that's what my donut would be. But let's face it, that's not true. Really, really not true. Right, there we go. I've, uh, I've, uh, ooh, look, clouds. Um, I put, like, shit around the, uh, the fucking giant, um, 
what you call it, the hill. So let's just get some cool new zones going. There we go. Right, let's just demolish that. Go demolish! Yeah. And then we just get more. That looks better. Much better. Okay, just get the water flow. Oh, it's already got water. Alright! And by the way, a disaster once more awaits all of my Sims, but residential demand is just through the roof. So, um, yeah. Sims flock to grand opening of Betty's Bird Boutique. Alright, that's so cool. Where is it? Is it one of those blue buildings that's already collapsed, or is it a stall in Crazy Larry in one of many Crazy Larry's flea markets? Could be any one of them. Even yours on the corner of your streets. And by the way, it's uh, 1901. Um, for some reason, the budget didn't come up. Yeah. Um, I'll have to just quickly. I think I I'll switch auto budget off. That's why. Um, city options, turn auto budget off. There we go. So now I'll get the budget at the end of every year. So I know it's a bit late, but let's have a look at the budget. It's not doing bad. I've got a tiny little income going. I've burned through nearly half of my starting money, but fair enough, because, you know, I'm spending that shit on, well, just getting Donut Island going. I mean, that's what I've built so far, but I've got a lot more to build on. You know what? I might even try and make the island bigger. But that's for another time. So, sorry about London having a mysterious death, but... Let's see what we could do with Donut Island. So next episode, more of growing the Donut Island. See you there, folks.